Welcome back to Ghost Recon Wildlands. This is part 24 and we are going up against Marcus Jensen in this episode. So if you all enjoy this video, give it a like and subscribe. Here we go. Target carrying submachine guns. I'm spotting another tango. Just spotted one with submachine guns. I got eyes on a sniper. Sicario over here. I don't see him. Over by the mortar. Marking an enemy. Watch out. Place is rigged with an array. Great order. mortars. Makes five. I got one narco over by the crate of comm gear. Eyes on a cartel heavy machine gunner near the sandbag emplacement. According to this, the cartel's getting their precursor chemicals from a company called Via B Gas. Looks like they cut a deal with the refinery chief to obtain the chemicals on the open market. We should have a talk with this gentleman. Buckle up, people. Sniper up in the tower. 
Tango knows somebody's got a beat on him. Hay disparos, todos cubranse. Por aquí están los gringos. Fuerzas enemigas en posición para mandar ataque. Solicitando fuego de apoyo. We've got the location of the cartel boss's house. Time to pay the boss a visit. Helicopter incoming. decided to show up to fight. Look at that. Pretty good sized city considering the location. Reminds me a little bit of Houston. Everything is built around the oil refinery. Lieutenant's on the run. Get ready. Fire. A copy. Fire, fire, fire. Tell Sicarios to join in the fight.
perdido contacto con las tropas enemigas. Todas las unidades mantengan su información de búsqueda. The drone is up. Fucking mortar. Got another tango. Sniper, top of the tower. Hold up, they're gonna see you. Out of the cage. The real is trying to run. The alarm. What's our plan? and rebels exchanging fire. What's our plan? <laughs> Chopper inbound. Who's up for stealing a helicopter? That one's packed full of supplies the rebels could use. Let's grab it. Chopper, down, down. Engaging. Contact by the camp entrance. Copter, get down. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. Unidad bird approaching. Stay down. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. Hit the dirt. Helicopter. Looks like a data file containing a route map for a chemical shipment. We should use this to track down the convoy and take it out. We've got a possible location on the local Buchon's residence. Sweep the house and get me an ID on this asshole. Hang on, I'll drive.
got a target carrying submachine guns. That car's got an alarm. Looks like the boss's house. Let's go check it out. Enemy marked. I got another. That's five. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Got a couple of narcos. We're good, we're good. Roger that. Moving. Roger that. Target marked. Find a good position. Roger. Target acquired. Nobody here. Search the house, see if there's anything useful. Target is down. We're cool. We're cool. Got a location here for a chemical institute run by the cartel. Looks like the Buchon himself is responsible for training the students. Let's check it out. He makes five. Sniper out there. Marking a hostile. He's close for some locals. We don't want to kill somebody by mistake. I've got two Sicarios. In the public garden. Building up ahead. Looks like some kind of school. That's the Chemical Institute. Via B Gas, the local oil and gas company, used to train the locals and give them jobs once they graduated. 
And then, of course, the cartel showed up, and that all changed. Let's see if we can find the boss in there. We got a tango with multiple civilians around. Marking a tango. He's close to that local. Yo, cartel sniper, on the roof, see? Yo, we got a small cart by the building. Back it up, back it up. We got a few Sicarios here. Tell me where. By the building. HVT spotted. Looks like the local Buchan. Let's grab him and make him talk. Seeing two narcos here, right by the container. You're going to shoot. Watch the background. You gonna execute him because you're sniper. Feelings. There on the roof. Get that the kid. Don't hurt me. Oh God! Don't kill me! Please don't kill me! I don't know anything. I swear, I'm just an assistant. An assistant to who? Marcus Jensen. He, he's the boss, you know? He runs everything. Where can I find him? He's supposed to be at the witch's market later, but I don't know when. Get on the phone. Arrange a meeting with him at the market. Tell him it's important. Then you let me go? That depends on how convincing you are. Hey, it's me. Look, hey! there's something I, I need to show you. I can't tell you on the phone. Yes, it's important. Okay. He told me to meet him at the witch's market. In case you feel the need to call him back. Bowman, this is Nomad. The cartel patron in Libertad is a U.S. national named Marcus Jensen. Got it. Let me run the name and I'll see what comes up. Better make it quick. We're going after him now. Marcus Jensen majored in chemistry because that's where the steady careers were. Job security, health benefits, two weeks vacation, 401k. And best of all, people were hiring. Marcus got recruited right out of grad school by La Gringa. Shelter guy that he was, thought he was getting a job with the SB Corporation, a multinational pharmaceutical company based in Bolivia, which, of course, it is. He just didn't realize what the product was. But when he finally figured it out, he decided it didn't really matter. He's making more in one month than his friends make in five years. And best of all, chicks. So many chicks. Almost as important, for the first time in his life, he's getting respect. Lagringa Station Marcus at the Chemical Institute in Libertad Province. Over the past three years, he's been teaching cartel members how to produce high-quality cocaine. True, most of these idiots never made it past the second grade, but it appears they finally found a subject they're passionate about. As for Marcus, his rationalization is... Look, someone's gonna make the cocaine. Someone's gonna make the money. It might as well be me, right? 
You are right, Marcus. Just not for much longer. We've got intel on a convoy of precursor chemicals being delivered to Okoro. Make sure the convoy doesn't reach its destination. Tango's rolling up. Here we go. There's one cartel truck up. Hold on. Go. There's one cartel truck off the road. Hope the locals like the fireworks. Guess we're done here. Drone is airborne. Got another tango. I got a third target. I got another. That's five. Looks like coordinates for a precursor chemical stockpile here in Libertad. We need to take it out. We're good, we're good. Got a prime target for you. A massive stock of I'll cocaine pilot. precursors hidden in Libertad. Let's take it out. Tango marked, but he's got a civilian nearby. I see a team of Sicarios here. The parking area, see? Got it, moving. I need to get to a better Hold position. Up. Let me get a good sight line. Got the target. Target acquired. Say the word, boss. 
Gaging one. tangos. That's one less bad guy. Taking out those precursor stocks will slow cocaine production in Libertad to a crawl. Sniper's got us targeted. The local refinery chief is bringing in precursors for the cartel. Talk to this guy and convince him that working with Santa Blanca is bad for business. Hey, que pasa? Eyes on the refinery, Chief. Let's see what he's got to say. We need to add bird approaching. Stay down. What is this? Kitching out here too. We're here to deliver a message. Stop doing business with the cartel. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Cut the shit. We know Santa Blanca is getting his precursors from you. We want you to stop. Made it because his company keeps Libertad alive. If Santa Blanca doesn't get what they want, they can shut us down. I can't have that, understand? Yeah, we'll understand this. If you don't stop supplying the cartel, we'll shut the rigs down ourselves. Fuck off, pinche gringos. This guy's more stubborn than goddamn General MacArthur. Guess we'll have to do this the hard way, then. Saddle up. We're heading to the oil rigs. Looks 
Backup rolling in. We got a problem. Cartel soldiers incoming. The last yeah, of the yeah. oil rigs. Let's light it up. Cartel Sicarios are joining the fight. Last of the oil rigs. Time to talk to the Via B gas refinery chief. Let's see if this will convince. Wait. That's the last of the oil rigs. Time to talk to the Via. Hold up. Last of the oil rigs. Time to talk to the Via B gas refinery chief. Let's see if this will convince him to stop working with the cartel. Why, gringo? I've already told you the answer is no. Things have changed. Santa Blanca promised they'd keep your rig safe. They failed. The deal is null and void. If I stop supplying the cartel, they'll shut me down. And if you keep importing precursors for Santa Blanca, I'll blow up every goddamn Via B gas rig you've got left. Take your pick. What kind of fucking choice is that? You're no better than El Puto Cartel, you know that? This isn't about me. It's about you doing the right thing. The right thing? Don't make me laugh. Guess I don't really have a choice, though, huh? When the cartel sends Sicarius to kill me, it will be on your head. I can live with that.
I'll drive. We've ID'd the Buchon as an American national named Marcus Jensen. He's heading to a meeting at the witch market. Go find Good Jensen go. and bring him to me. Entering the witch market. El Mercado de las Brujas. This is where the locals come to buy good luck charms or love potions or even a curse for their enemies. No shit. Eyes up. If the intel is correct, Jensen could be here somewhere. What in the hell is a guy like Jensen looking for in a place like this? Whatever it is, it ain't good. Trust me. Eyes on Jensen. Take him alive. Back off! I'm a scientist! Hands! Show me your hands. Do it now. Fascists. You've got no right! I'm an American citizen! Stay where you are and put your hands on your head. Don't make me tell you again. Yeah? Or what? Hey, Shit, Jensen's getting away. That LT's getting away. Get your goddamn hands off me! You try that shit again and I'll put a bullet in both of your legs. You read me? Now shut up and move. I think that's all of them. This is bullshit. You can't just arrest somebody for going to a fucking market. Save it, Jensen. We know all about you and the cartel. What I don't get is this. You're a scientist, right? So what the hell were you doing at a place like the witch market? Processing cocaine isn't just about solvents and reagents. Not the way I do it, at least. I get powders from the brujos that speed the process along and make the result more potent. Yeah? Like what? Like, fuck you. That's proprietary information. You want my secret recipe, you gotta pay for it.
scientist. You got no fucking right, you hear me? You don't have any legal jurisdiction here. I mean, even if you did, I'm a U.S. citizen here on a legitimate work visa. You're facilitating the manufacture of an illegal substance. An illegal substance that provides income for a gang of rapists and murderers. Not my problem. I'm not holding a gun to someone's head. I'm not making anyone take any drugs. People make their own choices. That's what individual liberty is all about. Fair enough. Take this fuck outside and shoot him in the head. Wait! What the hell? You're right, Mark. Marcus, we don't have legal jurisdiction in Bolivia, so I'm going to exercise my individual liberty and ask my associate here to blow your goddamn brains wait, out. Wait, wait! You got something to say? Look, can we... Can we make some sort of a deal here? Sure we can. You tell me what I want to know, and I won't put a bullet in your sociopathic skull. Fuck! Fine! Fine! I'll tell you what you want to know. That's all I'm asking. Copy that. Thanks for the good word. We're displacing to the next AO now. The great writer Balzac once said, to have a family is to become hostage to fortune. I told El Yayo we had something in common. We're both too old to start over. Me to start a new organization. You to start a new family. 